Today we're going to be talking about the manufactured housing C85 series coils and the A2L sensors that come with them and just a little bit on how to wire it up. So the first thing we want to do before we get started is always disconnect our power so that we have no power going to the unit. Here's our A2L sensor wiring. You'll see each wire is color coded. It doesn't quite match the thermostat wiring, but that's why we went ahead and put labels on each of the wires to show you which wire goes where. So starting with the black, which is your common wire, the white, which is your 24 volts into the furnace, the blue, which is the Y connection for the outside unit and the thermostat, the red, which is for your thermostat and outdoor unit power, the green, which is for an optional alarm if the homeowner or end user chooses to do so, and the orange, which is for the Y connection for your indoor unit. So here we just kind of went ahead and demonstrated how to wire up to the furnace. Obviously some of these aren't gonna be wired up uh, just for demonstration purposes. But looking first at our orange wire, it gets connected to the yellow wire, according to the wiring diagram. You'll also see a purple wire hanging out here in the furnace, which is for an optional dehumidifier if you choose to use one. The next wire we have here is the black wire, which is your common wire and you'll show that wired up to the gray, which is the common for the furnace. And then the last one we have wired up is your white wire, which for the sensor is your power wire, and it gets connected to the red of the furnace. Just keep in mind that the wiring diagram for this will be included in the C85 coil install instructions, and the booklet for the air handler will also have its own wiring diagram. And for more great tips, head to edgetechhvac.com.